What up, y'all? It's your man Wayne Train back with another joint. And today, whoo, man, I'm happy. We got the Z42 in the building, bruh. Let's get it. If y'all know who I be, I go by the name Wayne Train. My real name is Dwayne Mims. You can search that up at the top. Might be easy to find your boy that way. We do tech videos, unboxings, all kinds of stuff involving the world of tech. Now, if any of that interests you, please consider subscribing to your boy. Today we got the Z Fold, bruh. The Z Fold is finally in the building. I'm not even gonna waste no time talking. Um, let's go ahead and get right into this. So, retail price, 2,000 bucks. This is not for the faint of heart. Um, we'll get into all the specifics and everything, but man, check it out, bro. Let's go ahead and do it. Ooh, boy, oh, <laughs> I apologize for the high pitched noises and all that, man. There it is, man. Change the shape, change the shape of the future. I'm with it. I'm with it, Samsung. Um, what you got in the box, so pretty basic. We're gonna get into, honestly, I got some ranting. I got a little bit of ranting in this video because for $2,000, I don't know. I don't know, but um, not much really here from what I've seen. We got the phone though. Oh man, check out the back. I'm gonna set this off to the side for a sec. Just to show y'all, so we got the Galaxy Z Premiere service as well. We'll talk about that early on. We'll go through this here in a second as well. We get the charger, 25 watt charger and cable and just some empty box. <laughs> so here we are back with the phone. Oh man. <laughs> Bruh. I like, I don't want to, I feel like I want to just spend time with this by myself. I don't even really want to record this like this. <laughs> I don't know. It's, it's, it's crazy. I love this. This is amazing. All right. So let me go ahead and give it that. Yes. 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 As you can see, the crease down the middle, it's got a little bit of, um, a little warpiness to it, but I mean, nothing crazy. Now look, what I will say is on the website, I thought this was going to be matte glass. I really did. I thought I seen black matte, but I guess I was wrong. But throw the specs up there. We got um, screen sizes and everything. Let's go ahead and cut it on. Bam, bam. Fingerprint scanner on the side, doubles as a power button. Got the volume up and down rocker there. Yeah, yeah. Let's go, bruh. Let's go. All right. Yo, this is like insane. Like, this is really, this is like really surreal. Like, I don't know. It's a weird feeling. I, didn't, I haven't even given its first close yet but this is crazy i'm not going to close it i'm not going to give it the first fold until so i'm gonna go ahead and get everything in here set up here we are in the phone let's go ahead and give it the first the first close i'm scared Oh boy, boy, man! All right, so if you don't know, I um I do own the razor. So this was my first taste of the foldable experience. I like this phone. I, like as much as I I hate the price, which is really driving why like my feelings about the phone. I like the phone. Dope. This is a different. This is a totally different concept. So I don't really want to compare these. A lot of people would. This ain't the same in the same game. This ain't this, they're not playing the same game. This is something different. This right here, off the bat. So 
there's a good I like the feel like there's a, there's something to love about this narrow body so this is the S20 Ultra nice and wide um, still a good feel you know not too big but you know this right here though I like I'm not mad at the thickness so let's go ahead and take let me let me show you the fingerprint scanner I think I might have to go into the settings but the way it works is you got to actually press the button to open so it's fast but you do have to press the button i'll go into the settings and check it out and see if you can change that but off top off rip man this this is some next level tech right here and I, i'm in love with it just off the bat i am in love with this phone <laughs> like i ain't even did nothing with it i don't even know if it can make a call yet bro i might got a defective unit I will do whatever I can to maintain this phone. I promise you, like this is, this is ridiculous. So I'm gonna go ahead, so I don't got like the network and everything set up. I'm gonna go ahead and get everything, uh, SIM and everything switched over and we'll be right back. All right, y'all, I'm back. So I apologize, all the emotions. I, I sincerely apologize if you're not into that kind of stuff but I will be posting it regardless. But so I'm back a little bit more calm, a little bit more reserved, uh, played around with it for a little while. A um, couple of things to start. So I want to get back actually to what was in the box. So if you are in the market for a Z Fold 2, be mindful. We got this little, uh, I was rushing to get it open. I didn't even read any of this stuff. So. Do not press on the screen or the, uh, what does it say? Do not press screen or front camera lens with hard sharp, or sharp objects, um, such as point or pen, fingernail, any of that. When folding, folding the device, make sure that there is no objects such as cards, coins, keys, placing between the screens. So um, just uh, keeping this whole thing clean. Uh, the device is not water or dust proof or whatever. Um, yeah, so there is a screen protector. There's an outer screen protector on the on the outer screen. There's also one on the inside. Uh, they say they need a professional. They suggest you have a professional take out the inner screen. So be mindful of that as, as well. Even for like people who already have the phone, yeah. Just if you end up watching my video, just be careful. Don't take that off. Uh, don't 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 do it. <laughs> I know it may seem like it's usable or it's easy, it's easy or whatever. Don't do it. So also the Z Premier service. Um, yeah, so you get one year screen replacement offer. Basically, it's not like a free one or anything. I don't believe. So was a screen replacement offer one time of warranty screen replacement within a year of purchase for the special price of 149 so you get to pay 149 if you break your screen who knows how much it costs if um, uh, once that uh, if you did it after the year or whatever or did it two times that year but now the device itself the phone itself I I'm, I'm, I know the first like the first part of the video is just nothing but emo nothing but emotions, but in reality, I really, really, really am in love with this phone. Um, I I don't know, like it's hard to explain. This is like a really it's the perfect feel for like a little mini tablet. So you know it it can definitely if you're the if you're the kind of person that wants to just kind of get rid of everything and dumb it, and uh, and um, minimize and just have one device you could do it probably with this phone um, i will say that after playing with this and then like the moments i'll go and pick up my s20 ultra it does not feel like i need to get rid of this in a hurry um in fact it actually feels really good as a compliment to this phone um and I, this is an this is an expensive combo. This is not something I suggest anybody to really even have. But um, like honestly, it does. It feels really good to have both of these phones. I don't have any plans on getting rid of this right away. 
Um, so we'll see what happens though, you know, time will tell. Um, I haven't really, I haven't got a chance to set everything up over here. Um, the other thing is like this being, this is an everyday phone. Dust and water, water resistant, um, all that. I don't have to really baby this one. Um, this one still has a little bit of that feel for me, especially with the whole, you know, making sure you don't have any objects, you know, coins or whatever. Not that I would put, I'm, I would suggest getting like a pouch or something to carry it around, but um, if you want to just put it in your pocket, just make sure you got clean pockets at all times. But a couple of the things that I do like right off the bat, I do love the uh, the side mount uh, fingerprint scanner. Pretty nice. Um, speakers. Let me go ahead. Let me go to a video real quick. Because um, speakers on this bad boy are low key under, like, I, I didn't expect it. I'll just say that. I, I, I really did not expect the speakers to be this loud. Uh, where's my channel? We'll go to my channel, watch a video. Okay, let's go. Better be patient with it rather than really make a big fuss about it. But it was definitely worse this year. Each update that I followed since then had slowly got rid of it. Up until now, I believe they've done a really good job with basically eliminating it. So you got a bottom or a speaker up here and speaker down here. My video is not doing it justice. Um, let's go ahead and play. Let me find some um, copyright free music or something. So, I mean, even this song, I don't know why. I was playing it upstairs watching the video. The, the volume was super loud. Not that this wasn't really loud itself. Um, for comparison's sake, let's go hear it on the, uh, the S20 Ultra here. Yeah, I think it's definitely louder on the uh, Z Fold 2. So, should be, I mean, $2,000 phone, you know, but this is still a $1,400, $1,500 phone after taxes and whatnot. So, um, definitely no slouch in his own right. Uh, which you also may not have noticed is the sides. Um, they got like a nice, um, I don't know the, like the word. So it's like a, I don't know, it's like, it's like an, an engraving or something. It's, it's pretty cool. I don't think they've ever done that before. Um, I like it. So, uh, some things I don't like off the bat, uh, no, just limited 256 gigabytes of storage. Uh, the 12 gigabytes of RAM should be uh, sufficient. I don't expect to have any uh, issues there. The cameras actually are pretty good. Uh, I mean, I wish that they would have put top of the line everything, but you know, it is what it is. You're not getting that same camera over here, but that's fine. Like I said, just having both of these phones different, differ in different ways, camera, uh, just one handedness, all that. Um, and over here, you still get a good set of cameras, but you're not getting like 
just the newest, latest, and greatest stuff. But um, one, oh yeah, one other thing that I really do like. So if you do, you know, you ever do try it, or you get the phone, or you would, or whatever, um, and you're browsing, I would su definitely suggest keeping it in desktop mode. A lot of people probably do anyway, but especially with this screen. Um, desktop mode is feels a lot more comfortable. Um, it doesn't seem, you know, ridiculous. But you know, here I am right now. Go home. Go like ESPN or something. I still don't have no network on this. I'm just going straight uh, straight off the Wi-Fi. So if it seems a little slow, I'm in a basement. So. There we go. I know it's a little tiny from the camera, but like I, I, I like this. Like, yeah, it's smaller. I can always zoom in just a little bit, but I'm getting that full desktop view on a bigger screen. So I like it. I like it a lot. Um, also, I enabled like this uh, gesture feature on the on the fingerprint scanner. Okay, here we go. So we got fingerprint sensor gestures. Um, Basically, I'll say open sensor perfect. Oh wow, hold on. Okay, so you can also use that. I'm not gonna do it, but um, actually I ain't got nothing set up. So from the home screen, swipe up the fingerprint scanner or sensor to open up Samsung Pay. So basically, right now I got it swiped down. Uh, it opens up the notification joint, but you can also open up Samsung Pay by swiping up. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. I like that. <laughs> um, let's see. I think you could probably do it from the... Uh... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And this also... This makes a lot more sense from the uh, for this screen here. So, yeah, yeah. I like this. I like this a lot. So, yeah. Early impressions, man. I I can't wait, man. I got, I got so much stuff I got to do to this... I'm I'm a, I'm a, I'm a really I'm doing this different. I know I say that a lot. I say it a lot. I say it a lot. We're going to do it. Just doing it now. Got a lot of videos I want to put out about this phone. Uh, first impressions though, man, are amazing. I I like it. I love it. Uh I I want this to be a success. Um I'm really hoping that you know, obviously you can't control any of the, uh, I mean, stuff is gonna happen. I'm pretty sure there's gonna be some screen issues. Mine might have a screen issue, heating issues, battery, and all that type of stuff. Um, I'm hoping none of that happens. I really do. I really, really want this to be a successful phone because this is an amazing piece of tech. I love everything about this thing. Like, I didn't even get to discuss the flex mode thing. Like, it's the hinge itself seems really sturdy. Like it's it's a nice like just man I don't know man <laughs> get it uh, I didn't even really get to discuss the the front screen that much um, the front screen is really narrow um, it's probably somewhere around twenty one by nine like similar to those Sony phones but like it's it's cool but like I said it's not really. Like I see a lot of people say that they like they they find themselves using this screen a lot. I I, I can't do. I really can't. Like I, I can't stop opening this phone and going into the main main display. I need to be here. Like this is this is why I'm here. So and I'm not even forcing it. Like this this here is serviceable. But if you find yourself with a Galaxy Fold and you're using the main this main display more than the inside display, you probably shouldn't have the Galaxy Fold. Um, you, you probably shouldn't. So just keep that in mind. Um, let's take a couple shots though real quick to show you. Shutter speed or whatever.
Now I probably I was what I was hearing is um these are these camera this camera setup is probably more closely related related to the uh, the S20 line, so which took really good photos. Check out that flex mode. Let's swipe here. Swipe your pictures that you took. Take a photo. Okay. What else we got here? A lot of settings, a lot of, oh man. I don't even know what that is, honestly. But, I don't know, man. There's so many things I gotta break down on this phone, but all in all, like I said, impressions are first impressions. I, I love it. Um, we're gonna take it day by day, uh, all the way up to the review. I'm gonna have some comparisons and we'll, we'll we'll do it up. So let me know in the comments what you guys think, uh, what you want me to see or what you want to see. Uh, specifically, I'll try to make it happen. And uh, yeah, man, that's the Galaxy Z Fold unboxing. Um, like, subscribe, share, do it up for your boy. It's your man Wayne Train. Once again, I apologize for all the emotions, man. I got, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I'm just, I'm just really amazed by this, so. It's your man. I'm out.